passion and loyalty. This is the most intense crowd in the whole country. It's terrifying. There's no other way to describe it. Who are these potential new owners? I've inherited a fragmented, disillusioned team. That I believe in what we were doing as a club? Absolutely not. This club recently went 12 months without winning a single game here. The football club being sustainable is integral to the happiness of the entire city. This is what stops people crying in church. If we're going to get this club turned around, it has to be done now. We might have a problem. There are other clubs interested in a lot of our players. The bigger issue is whether they actually want to stay. There's so much at stake. This is a highlight of my career as a player for some of them. We've got two kids, and what if? You just don't know what's going to happen next. Our fans, this is their money going into the football club. They trust us. So what are our middle management doing? We're still in a firefight. This was f***ed. It is a failed f***ed up business. And unless you guys understand that, you'll never f***ing make it in this world. This football club is going to kill me. To harness the passion of the fans. Time for a rebirth of this football club and the renaissance of Sunderland. That intensity and that emotional support can be like an unstoppable force. Sunderland is emotionally tough. When it's bad, it is a place of despair. When it's good, you are absolutely invincible.